This video is for American government. We're looking at the highlights from pages 214 to 217. We're talking about financing the state and uh, local government. So uh, first thing that I want you to notice in talking about financing, uh, first of all, the only revenue that government actually has is taxes. So everything that the government spends, uh, pretty much everything, is coming from the taxes that are paid by uh, the working people. So notice in uh, the first paragraph there on page 214, in the early 1960s, all state and local governments combined were spending approximately $70 billion a year. $70 billion is a lot of money. By 1993, just three decades later, they were spending about $1.2 trillion a year. That is about 17 times greater than they were spending in the 1960s. 17 times greater, from $70 billion up to $1.2 trillion. Now, part of this is due to inflation. Uh, but a large part of it is a result of uh, citizens insisting that state and local government provide them with, with more and more services. Um, there are, uh, there's welfare services, there's uh, state programs for uh, all kinds of crazy things. Uh, the bureaucracy of the government, the, um, the appointed but non-elected officials is just uh, crazy out of hand. And all of those people need to get paid and all of them are paid through tax money. Uh, so let's look at the limits on uh, taxing power. The U.S. Constitution and state constitutions put uh, certain limits on taxing power. Uh, the 14th Amendment has been interpreted to prohibit the states from what's considered unreasonable taxation. I suppose everybody has a little bit of a different idea on what uh, unreasonable taxation is. On the second column of page 214, uh, with uh, find sales tax and highlight, the single most important source of revenue among the states today is sales tax. Um, I believe all but four or five states have uh, sales tax. Uh, New Hampshire uh, don't have sales tax. New Hampshire is... Uh, one of those and uh, the ranges there are uh, a little bit different now. I think the book is a touch uh, touch behind. Some states have uh, have higher sales taxes than what's listed here. Uh, so uh, 45 of the 50 states levy a general sales tax uh, that applies to most products. Uh, they'll leave it off of things that are considered essential. So usually um, there isn't any tax applied to, um, to essential food products and things like this and, uh, and medicines. Uh, then there are selective sales tax, uh, that's some things such as gasoline, tobacco products, alcoholic beverages, and certain other commodities. Uh, so various kinds of taxes there. On page 215, uh, we've got some more kinds of taxes listed. Find uh, property tax on the second column. Highlight, today, the property tax is the chief source of income for local governments. So we have sales tax, the uh, single most important source of revenue among the states. Property tax is the chief source of income for local governments, so counties and cities. Uh, across the nation, it provides an average of about 75% of the local tax collection. Uh, property tax goes towards things like public education, uh, street repair, uh, police and fire protection, all things like that. Uh, so we don't really have a whole lot of, um, of highlights for today, just those two actually. Um, so just make sure that you complete your reading. Um, and uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, we are kind of getting to the end of our book here. And uh, you'll be getting some things um, this week when, uh, when the principal drops things off 
that will uh, get you ready for uh, the end of the year and uh, reviews and things like that. Hopefully we'll be able to uh, be together for the last week of school and uh, get in a final test. We'll see how that goes. Um, and yeah, so get your homework done. Uh, make sure that you are getting your work done. Keep in mind that um, all of these homeworks are your grades for the entire fourth quarter. Um, we're not really having any quiz grades. Um, your verses and uh, the preamble are counting for quiz grades, so it's essential that you do well on those. Um, otherwise, um, uh, there's not much else that we can do for this, uh, this fourth quarter grade. So make sure that you are uh, getting those done, and I uh, hope you guys are staying safe and uh, being productive, and I uh, hope to see you all soon.